like America, for example, where like a guy would like rob his car and he'd like fight the guy. And I'm like, dude, you're just, you're going to die. <laughs> like you're going to get shot. You're going to, you're going to get killed. It's not worth like dying. Just also like I've seen a lot of videos of like store owners, like uh, yeah, tobacco yeah. stores or like these small gas stations. And then, yeah. you know, they really like risk their lives for, yeah, for a true. couple of bucks. It's true. Yeah. Like somebody's literally holding a gun to their face and they're like, okay, I'll comply. And then they like yeah. grab their shotgun. I know, I know. Like that's, it, is, that's... it is weird. It is, it is weird to do. It's like, do you really want to risk your life over like? It's not rational. It's yeah, not it's rational. Not but rational. it's like, I think it's something like you know they didn't want to get humiliated or yeah. they, I don't know, matter of pride and. But also at the same instinctual. time, I can understand money is important to people. Like, for example, there, there was a video of like this this guy. He was in like an Uber or a Lyft, and he was getting carjacked by these two people. Yeah, these two girls like they had to taser, and they were like carjacking this guy. I think it was like it's like this Pakistani guy who was in America, and he literally fought for his life to save his car. And even though it seems irrational, I can understand from his perspective, like that's his life. Like, yeah, his life is his car, and his job is to yeah. drive his car. Like, yeah, you're literally taking his whole like <laughs> well being away from him. So I can kind of. Wait, also, was that an Uber driver or? I think it was. It was probably an Uber driver, either Uber or Lyft. I think it might have been Uber. But I feel. I yeah, feel that yeah. Guy. I can understand that at the same time because a lot of people are struggling to like make ends meet with inflation, cost yeah. of living. So taking people's money is a big deal to them. So I don't want to like downplay like taking people's money. Yeah. But at the same time, it's like a cost benefit analysis. You have to like think to yourself: Is it rational for what I'm doing? Yeah. If someone's gonna like steal like fifty bucks from the cashier. Like let to give them the money. Don't 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 get into a gunfight over fifty bucks. Mm. But then if it's like a if it's like a serious thing, like like a lot of like expensive stuff, like your car, I can understand some pushback. But I mean, at some point, you know, I don't know if yeah. if you're at the the brink of you know not making ends meet and maybe you yeah. know starving. I'm that doesn't happen in the West to yeah. to a large extent at all. But let's yeah. say maybe in like a developing part of the world, like maybe uh, Africa or India. Yeah. And somebody's like stealing all of your, like, uh, you know, your, the, the mm -hmm. thing that makes, that gives you your daily bread. Yeah. Like that's going to be, you know, he's, he's maybe threatening your life at that yeah. point. So then it makes, it makes more sense. More because, sense. Yeah. Cause I, I have seen videos of people in more poorer countries, like fighting robbers. I can understand that because a it's like money is hard to come by. So taking someone's money is like way more destructive to their well being. Yeah. And see like and, and be like the actual police are super incompetent. So if somebody steals from you, there's like a very low likelihood that the police are gonna do anything. And the robbers they they do benefit a lot because if, if a if a robber robs your stuff, you know, they're 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 gonna benefit. The, the police yeah. aren't gonna catch this guy, you know, the police are incompetent. So Yeah. The police are probably corrupt themselves, they're probably gonna try to steal from you as well, you know. So it's, Wait, it's, where are we talking about right now? Oh just in general, like I hope you enjoyed that clip of the HH podcast. If you want to see another clip, click here, down to your left. And if you want to see the whole unedited episode, click down here to your right. And last but not least, if you want to subscribe, you can do so here in the middle. Thank you.